Hello, I'm Dr. Pamela Ruig, Extension Mount Quality Veterinarian for the University of Wisconsin-Madison. And today we're introducing a new series all about using somatic cell count to evaluate subclinical mastitis. Now, if you're a regular viewer of our video series, you'll know that subclinical mastitis is the most common form of the disease on many dairy farms. And we diagnose it based on observation of the cow's immune response to an intramammary infection. However, in, you'll notice I said we diagnosed it based on observation of the immune response. And the only way we can observe that immune response is to measure the somatic cell count of individual cows. So in this series, we're going to have a, um, be speaking about how to use somatic cell count to manage subclinical mastitis. And if you want to dive more deeply into this topic of subclinical mastitis in general, we'd encourage you to go back and review one of our early videos called Subclinical Mastitis in Dairy Cows. Mm -hmm.